Can you explain to them why there haven't been any videos? Yeah, and then what? Then what happened? And then, then what? <sighs> I, wouldn't, I wasn't going to tell them that bit. Like and subscribe, that was, I think. Right, I just, I just thought I'd use you as a cute child at the start. Cause I've, been, I've been away for 10 days, so I thought I'd just involve you. And then no one will give me grief because all the comments will be about you. So, thoughts? Don't that? Don't don't meddle. Don't meddle. Don't oi. There's there's rules. Doug, please. That was Doug. Uh, he's one soon. So you're older than you thought, aren't you? Uh, spent a month trying to get a house. We didn't didn't get the house. <laughs> so <laughs> that's why there aren't mean videos because we tried really hard to get a house. Didn't get the house we want. We go again. Uh, as a result, Thames is back in full force. So with one disappointment comes probably more disappointment. Let's run the intro. Hello then, folks. Welcome back to another episode of the ever, the ever exciting AFC Thames. Now, uh, you could be forgiven if you don't remember uh, what happened last time we met. It was a 3-1 defeat to Manchester City, um, which we then followed up spectacularly with a 2-2 with draw with Sheffield United. But as you can see, January has gone very, very well. Now, look, there's, there's, there's things going on this season that are unexpected. We are top of the league table right now by a couple of points. And Manchester United, the team we face today, a, t a titan of English football, sit in 10th position. So a chance maybe for us to do something, hopefully, quite magical. Um, as you can see, the run of form in the January has been ex exceptional, apart from the FA Cup, where we lost to Watford. If there's one thing guaranteed, I will go out to an inferior side at the first round of the FA Cup every single time. Um, so there it is once again. Happened in, in the Vanaramas. Happens now as well. And it should be said as well, and I signed this boy now quite a long time ago in my life, it must be said, uh, Peter Landrup. I actually tweeted about him at the time. People remember. It was, I think it was two 2013 that it happened um peter andrew i brought in it was it was a quite a big when he's signing 13 million pounds five goals in four games it's fair to say he's had an impact since arriving here at Thames. And team-wise then, how many of these names do you remember is the question. Uh, Nee will, of course, continue in goal. Acacio, Brazis, Pintado and uh, Jordi at left back. Of course, if you're not watching this live as they come out, you won't. They, you will not have noticed the gap in between. So you hopefully you'll enjoy the same. Uh, Juan Jose and Salatiel in the centre. Melon behind Urban Trout and Agnonovic will be on that left-hand side. I still haven't figured out how to say his name. So, Leon Urban Trout, he is the main man, of course. Course. this is the man we we rest our hopes and dreams on 24 goals in 23 appearances let's see then today can it be the day that we don't just say we're going to win this league but we're proving that we maybe 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 can by beating a side in 10th it's still man united i mean come on i appreciate your patience i know it's not easy to follow me at the moment um i'm 31 soon so you know that's exciting and how is that little boy nearly one years old like in like 10 days or something like how how has that happened it's not 10 days, 15 days. Um, as far as Eddie's concerned, I've always said 15 days there. So, all right then, United. Now, <laughs> our run last time I played was very good. I won't lie to you viewers, I've not played Thames for 10 days. So we're about to find out uh, how I remember the boys, if I can pronounce any names correctly. We've always sort of, we've always sort of discovered that that's not the case. And um, yeah, so uh, for those that are unaware, I have tweeted about this and I have done um, Discord posts about it, but of course you don't all follow me on Twitter. You don't all follow, like, follow uh, <laughs> apparently talking is becoming possible. So that's good, that's new. Uh, you're not you're not all in the Discord, I don't think. You can be. Discord.gg slash Dr. Benji if you want to be. Um, yeah, I've, I did sort of like a statement explaining where I'd been. Uh, we tried really hard to rent a new house and uh, that became increasingly difficult, which meant it took more of my time. Um, and then eventually the landlord changed his mind with a day to go. So... <laughs> I'm fine, viewers. Uh, that explains why there haven't been Norwich stuff, because I've not streamed in that time either. Um, yeah, and there haven't been any videos. But look, this week, and I say this a lot, this week there will be a video every single day. I will I will, I will, will make sure of it. For every day there isn't, I'll give away a copy of the next Football Manager. So if that's not going to hold me to it, then nothing will. If there is any FM... Like, have they said anything yet? Do we know? I, no one's sure. Um, right, here we go then. We, Of course, we play red and white, if you've forgotten, as a shot goes in. Now, look. It would be it would be remarkable for those that have followed the story throughout. Like to, for us to win the league 
this season seems ridiculous. But with Leon Amantra up front doing what he's been doing in recent times, how can you possibly doubt us at this stage? And that's what makes it so exciting. As uh, we are on the ball right now, as Manchester United in their all black kit, kit try to defend this. As the ball's played in, Randrop ducks it down. Amantra does some weird back headery thing. I'm not sure what that was. Regardless, it didn't go in. Another chance for us. Acacio, what? Oh dear. Okay. Well, we've given the ball away quite quite easily there. As uh, what still annoys me about this team is that we're not at our stage. We still play at Sellers Park, which is the, the ground of Crystal Palace, as uh, United have caught that up big time. We're in. He's got to put it back for Leon, surely. He's going alone. He's got, he's got to do better there. Ball played in by United. Melon heads it away. Acacio launches one clip. It's flicked on. I feel like we probably could have done more there. Uh, maybe not, as the ball goes about, <laughs> all the way back to the goalkeeper. It nearly went tremendously wrong for them. Half an hour gone, and it's interesting because... And one of the reasons we picked United originally was because in terms of team, they are so, uh, so much better. Bridge is very good. I mean, that's not a very good shot, though, is it? I mean, the keeper there, it's, it's, it's taken three days to get to the goal. Um, they uh, On paper, United should be smashing us, like absolutely smashing us, as should most of the sides, it should be said, sort of in and around the top 10. If you bring the league table up, like I would say... Yeah, I'd say all of those teams <laughs> in the top 10, even the likes of Tottenham, maybe even Newcastle, West Ham are better than us. Again, in terms of personnel and our pre-season odds sort of explain that maybe all the sides are better than us technically. But I, I don't know. We've just, we found some momentum um, and that momentum is now being ripped away, it feels like, as uh, we are 1-0 down to United at home. It's not ideal. Again, they need to get their season back on track. Maybe this is their route to doing that and they're using us as the, as the lever for it. As, uh, yeah, City go to the top of the table. And of course, now we've got a battle between ourselves, City, Liverpool, and maybe even Thames FC as well. Things could get very, very spicy this season. As Erman Trout makes his way forward. It's a difficult... Oh, it's no such thing as a difficult angle for Erman Trout. That, my friends, is spectacular. It's Thames 1. It's Manchester United 1. And uh, yeah, that is what you want to see from the boys. A lovely stuff. I mean, the, the, the ball across field from them was pretty questionable. Randrup plays it to Ermintra. I'm thinking, you're going to have to get closer than that, Sunshine. You can't shoot from there. But, well, how wrong was I? Bustos cannot keep it out. And uh, it's back to 1-1. One, one. And, and one thing is for sure, then, viewers, Ermintra is still a good footballer, which is good news. As uh, we, we level things at the top of the league table as things stand with Manchester City. Again, we had that little that little lead going into this, so I suspect that they're winning their game. We're drawing ours, of course. Our goal difference is superior. They've actually won more games than us, which suggests they've drawn a couple. Uh, sorry, we've drawn a couple more and they've lost there. We've only lost one game again this season. Remember, it was last episode against Manchester City. So if we'd have won that, who knows where we'd be. Um, substitution at this point. I mean, we've got options, right? Jakob, I think Wolk. Uh, is it Wolk or Wolk? Yes, yeah, it's, it's, like, it's like Wolf, but it's very confusing. Uh, he's going to come on. Um, Erman Trout's going to stay out there, not having a great performance, but the goal seems to have made a, a little bit of a difference. Ten minutes to go. Can we stay in the lead here as there's going to be a goal kick to Manchester United? It would be a beautiful return, as I seem to all my videos are returns at the moment. <laughs> it would be a beautiful return <laughs> if we're to win this. As I'll be cut it out brilliantly. Melon now, as he can maybe drive forward with it, finds Erman Trout. Again, difficult angle. Not going to get there. Keeper clears it away. United will be first to that. And of course, that ball in behind, always dangerous on football manager this year, it feels like, as um, the ball forward to this left-hand side is dangerous. Acacio is going to have to get across. He's not really getting across. The ball's drilled all the way across. Knee doesn't get to it. Wanderson puts it in, and it's Manchester United 2, Thames 1. And that's not what we wanted to see at all. I guess we have to attack now. We kind of have to go for it in the final few moments. It's not been a great performance. It's not been vintage AFC Thames this season. Uh, it's going to be a defeat. And, well, the last episode was. Fortunately for me, the time in between, as this is going to be... Okay, well, that's gone then. Uh, the time between games has been so long that it doesn't feel like we're losing every game at the moment on video, which is fine. But we are. That's the reality of it. Uh, we now need to see, then, can we bounce back from this? Should we play Forest? Let's play Forest. See, I'm true. You didn't think that was happening, right? did you? Well, you did. You've seen the time of the video. You know. All right. Defeat there. Tottenham win. Two sendings off for Burnley. Um, fascinating and curious. Right then. Game two. After defeat to United, can we bounce back? Can we now produce a win when we need it? It feels like now again to keep that momentum going this season. Like you're going to lose sometimes to the bigger teams. Uh, Evan Trout's got an injury. Now, do you risk a player with a tight thigh, viewers? I, I mean, I have in the past. Would I do it now? It's difficult. Packy McCarthy could come in. He could play. I think Jakob is the guy. Like, Jakob was signed as a striker backup option. He's very similar to Ermantra. It makes sense, I guess, that he plays in this one. And uh, Aganovic has got that little injury. He's so good, by the way. I think we forget just how good this man 
Dan is. The fact we've not had a bid for him yet this this window is surprising. He's been wanted for a while, as have a couple of the other boys. Um, I think we probably keep him in there for now. Again, he's usually a top performer for me. It's not really... Well, I say top performer. His season's actually not been that good. Again, it's been 10 days for us. My, the, the, the memory's gone. Um... We're going to carry on as we are. I'm not going to make the change. Again, Walt can come in later in the game if we need him to. Again, Erman Trout, tight thigh off the bench. We might still bring him on if we're in search of a goal. Even though we lost that last game, he still scored. That's That tends to be the way with him. Again, no FA Cup distractions this season either. So that's comforting for us. Um... Are we in Europe? I can't. I actually can't remember. No, of course we're not. I, and, and when I say of course we're not, this is why. I don't know why I'd forgotten. 11th last season. Now we're battling for a title. The Champions League places would be perfect. Uh, we're wearing white today. Don't get confused by the red and white of Nottingham Forest. As uh, the first chance of the game is going to be Forests, I think, as they flip the ball away. I love it when defenders actually are, are stuck in mud entirely. Two of them, in fact, as the shot goes in. He probably should have scored, viewers. We're going, to we're going to speed up the highlights as well. We're going to we're going to add a bit of tempo to this, viewers. Come on. I guess we can get the videos back on track now, though, right? Let's get the channel back on track a little bit. You know, I can focus. I know I'm going to be here for a little longer now, so I don't have to worry about moving my whole life. So so now life is a bit easier in that sense. There's one Jose. It's a, it's a very casually caught. I love that. From Carlos Alberto. I respect it. As the, as the, as the clearance forward is also very good. As uh, Doherty now, though, on that side. Or Doherty. Or, or Doherty. Never know anymore, viewers. Uh, Pintana does brilliantly and now can he find the right ball forward again we've, we've, we've commented on how fantastic he is he didn't showcase it there they're in on goal it's a brilliant bit of defending but blimey Pintado there does absolutely excellently and it remains at nil nil again with the away side I think we're a little bit too passive actually as Forrest do brilliantly to keep that in on this near touch line we, we do need to get a bit more aggressive with it maybe and because I've up the speed as well it feels like there's a lot more tempo to the game all of a sudden as why are we not doing defending the shot goes just wide just sort of watching players run by us it's very brave see the problem you've got now as well is that Liverpool and Thames with a game in hand on us City this is where if I'm not careful they run away with this but I mean on the plus side we are definitely not going to be relegated so that is good we've got about what 13 games to go after this one it'd be a nice one to win and maybe this is the first time we're going to get a chance to see us actually have a shot on goal and produce uh never mind we've given it away we've passed it backwards they're just running through our central defenders like our central defenders are going this way sir yeah uh, table for two is it like what are we doing wake up please i'm far from pleased with the performance i'm gonna have to get angry there's no there's no other option for me uh we'll go attacking as well up the tempo of everything basically we should i think in terms of the pace we've got up front we should be out working forest at this point 18th place forest as well by the way let's not forget that as um the performance out on the left-hand side, once again, abysmal. I'm going to put Dominic Doles out there. Not because I necessarily think he's excellent at left wing. I just think he's excellent at doing well for me. And that's good enough for me. He's not quite on yet, though, as this highlight is going to happen before he's introduced. As Forrest keep the ball in the centre of the pitch quite smartly. Lapazette has got it now. Slides it through. We're a disgrace. Um, We are a disgrace. Is it going to be one of the best bottle jobs in a while? Good. I hope so, because it seems to be. <sighs> I'm going to risk him. I'm going to try on. Guarantee he's a goal a game for that's the difference he's a goal game the tight thigh will have to be risked here if he pulls a hamstring now um there'll be one person to blame as is this the is this a highlight as own child chips it forward from the kickoff why the game does this sometimes i will i will never know i don't think this is a real highlight it's not it's just it's just taking its time to do the changes that i've asked for nonsense viewers so now not only are we are we draw we're losing now so that and, and i've done the research views you don't get any points for defeats so um, not even pride, really. Uh, not, not not anymore. Malon does brilliantly here, by the way. Racing forward, Erman Trout. Oh, he's at the bar. He's just come on as well. That would have been that would have summed up the fact he gets a goal a game. Problem is, it is a goal every ninety minutes, and I've got I've not given him nearly nearly enough time. Demar more for the boys. I mean, come on, R Rand Randrup, by the way, on that right hand side has had a shocking performance so far. Uh, our options out there. There aren't any. So he's going to have to stay out there and be pathetic, which is a real shame for us, as they've got a free kick. We've already lost to United. Are we now about to lose to Forrest? Knee comes and claims the ball. Very casual for everyone involved. I'm, yeah, fine. Ball out to this left-hand side. There he is. The main man, Dolls to Erman Trout. It's been held up. Oh, it's a good save from the goalkeeper. It was actually quite a good shot for Erman Trout, but it doesn't find the back of the net, as there's not long left to go at all. Randrup, I mean, I can't really take him off because we've not really got anyone to bring on to replace him what we can do is put him further forwards and he and he's, ve like, he's he's actually very good so let's see if he can just maybe role change place change 
positional change, I think, is the word you're looking for, Ben. Uh, can we fight back? Or is this a uh, welcome back, everybody? I've lost two games on the bounce. It's going to be a great end to the season. Four points will be the gap. We might be... Oh, God. Heavens. All right. There's not long left to go at all here. Encourage the boys. Anyone? Anyone want to put in a performance for me? Just one person. One shot will do. And it takes a second to score a goal. Oh, not for them, obviously. They've missed. It's fine. I mean, the central midfield have been a joke as well. I mean, did we, did we get them off? I didn't put any central midfielders on the bench. It's great to be back, viewers. Some things never change. I've not learned anything in my time away, clearly. Time's ticking away here. I've got I've got very little I can change. Maybe we're too attacking. Maybe the tempo is too fast. We'll slow things down a touch by going positive. There are four minutes of added time. I've got I've got no shouts left because we've got 10 minutes to wait before the next one. Two minutes to go. Is there a shout now I can do? Yes, I will encourage one final time, viewers. Is there to be a moment, a late moment of absolute drama as the clock is... Well, no, there isn't. We've lost a forest. Um, why is the, 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 the clock just carried on? Um, well, I'm not happy with the performance, obviously. <laughs> Thought I was going to win the league this season. Thought, you know what? doesn't matter when I start doing thames again because we're going to win the league and it'll be great and now it's not and i'm sad to get oh dear one job for manager one job meanwhile city dominant away at west ham and now the chase is on the goal difference is identical four points is the gap and it's gonna be difficult <laughs> yeah see that's not great that is it that's that's not great the only thing we can say we play thames fc right we play arsenal liverpool city tottenham that there's quote unquote big teams we play them all so the reality is if we do well in those games then we've always got a chance. And I think it's those games we'll focus on against the rivals of our current league campaign. So with that in mind, we'll be back. Might be, maybe as soon as tomorrow for Tottenham and for Thames. Although there's a massive gap. I think Thames FC will come back for that one. Uh, Tottenham away after the recent form. I'm not confident at all. But we'll come back for Thames. It's the second, 22nd of, 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 uh, of February. We'll join us back for that one then. Hopefully, we can get our league campaign back on track. Lose to them though. And maybe we, even, we risk slipping out of the top four. Uh, if you enjoyed today's video, uh, folks, please do leave a like on it. If you aim for a thousand likes, that'd be fantastic. Um, again, sorry for the inconsistency. Hopefully the reasons are adequate. Um, I don't feel good about it. So <laughs> I'm so sorry. We'll see you again tomorrow, 5 p.m. I promise. If not, I'll give away a copy of Football Manager. I mean, it's basically now Willy Won't He? So it's very exciting.